Okay, people, today I just want to pray for somebody who has been in cage. Sometimes we are living our life, we see that nothing is going well with us. We see it in our downline, in our family lives, in our brothers and sisters' lives, cousins, nephews, just name it. Nothing is working. They cannot prosper in anything. They are of age. They have nothing to show for it. No house, no investment, no business, no nothing. No, everything is like a standstill. This is because you have some manifestation in your life which has imprisoned you. God opened my eyes yesterday night to see that a lot of people was imprisoned in the spirit man. Many people's spirit being is walking on the earth, but only the body is walking on the earth. But the spirit is imprisoned. And once your spirit is imprisoned, you need cleansing. You need cleansing, you need strong prayers, and you need God's divine intervention to deliver you from that dark place that you find yourself. Don't take it for joke, people, because you see some people, they are working, working for many years, but they don't know where their money is going. They have imprisoned you to just be a slave in work. You will work and work and work and you will not earn anything because a spiritual battle is happening in your life to not increase you and always make you to be at one position. I'm a witness to that. Those things were happening in my life and I just got to realize them that I was in prison. Like last night, I saw the vision of myself and I was like in tears said, God, why I did not know this all these years. You can be imprisoned by manipulation of evil forces. Don't take it for a joke. It's a reality. It's happening in our world we live. They have manifestation of evil forces. You will see people who are in your life, you call them family, you call them friends, you call them strangers. But these manipulation, they carry your name places and these things, they imprison you in your very day-to-day -day life. You see it like, oh, nothing happening to me. You can't see it because they have imprisoned you and you are blinded by the shadows of them not making you to see that you are just at a standstill. Many bad hobbies, you are drinking, you are taking drugs, you are bringing yourself down. You cannot go up, you cannot come down, you cannot go on the side. You just see yourself in anger. You see yourself just destroying everywhere. You see yourself just breaking down. You see yourself not marrying. You see yourself just divorcing. You see yourself not into any kind of stable job or into stable things. It is because manipulation, manipulation is at work. Spare, invoking demonic spare in your life. So today, the Lord spoke to me last night and he said to me, go out there and pray for people who are in prison. Let God's intervention come into their lives. Those who are in prison, I mean in praising. A lot of people have been in praising by the foundation. Has been in praising by the idols from the father's house, from the mother's house. Has been in praising by those evil spirit that has been a part of the mother's or the father's life. Thank you, Jesus. God want me to pray for somebody right now. I have a God who never fails. I have a God who never fails. So, Father, right now, I just ask for forgiveness of my sin and the sin of all those who are watching this video. I just ask for mercy, 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 and forgiveness as we're about to call upon the upper room, the holy heavens. We say, Father, 
We stand upon your word and upon your authority that you have given unto us. You said in Matthew 18, 18, whatever we bow on earth shall be bound in heaven. Whatever we lose on earth shall be lost in heaven. And you has given us authority to break the yoke of principalities and power and the Holy Spirit to guide us through our acts in you, O oh God, to fulfill our prayers as we call upon it. And as I'm about to pray this hour, O oh God, I ask your intervention of your Holy Spirit to descend in the maze and the guardian angels, holy angel Michael, holy angel Gabriel, holy angel Uri, holy angel Raphael, to surround me, cover me, guard me, protect me. Angels of war, I sent you people on the battlefield. Because this battle is not for me to fight. This battle is for the God and his supreme team, you know, Mount Zion to fight. I send angels of war, warriors of war to fight war, to reach war. We are about to reach war against principalities and power that has encaged the life and imprisoned the life of so many people to be set free today in Jesus' name. Hmm. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes, as I close my eyes, I see the angels <laughs> coming from above, down on the face of the earth. Father, I thank you. Who am I? Oh, for you to hear me, oh God, because I did not come here by myself. I did not come here for no gain, no what, no material thing. I came here because you directed me to be before your people, to be for those who cannot see you, for those who can hear from you, for those who are weak, for those who cannot understand, oh, that they are surrounded by evil forces. Father, I thank you, Jesus, for your presence. So, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, today I ask the angels, guiding angels, all over the universe, angels of war, I say go into those different foundations. Go into those different foundations, those different idols, those different places where manifestation or manipulation has taken place. In the trees, oh God, in the ground, in the sea, in the rivers, in the bottles of God, in the rock, in the enchantment places of tying them up, oh God, in clove and in the nay, oh God, in the latter. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, I ask your Holy Spirit right now, your angels of war to range war against principalities and power in four cornerstones of the universe. I send every key of the angels to open every imprisonment, every lock, every prison house, everywhere they have hold them captive, hold them in prison, wherever they have taken the spirit man, the lock, the heart, the life, oh God, the image, I ask you, oh God, to uproot every curse from the father's house, from the mother's house, every evil tongue that has rise against them, every evil evil words that has been spoken into the life. Every manipulation of evil tongue that has been the cause of the problem. I release them with the blood of Jesus. I send the Holy Ghost fire. Judgment and fire. Internal fire. Chance of fire. I say right now I break walls of principalities and power. Every legal hold. Every legal hold that it has against their life. Whatever their hands are staking to carry them in the different shrine, Different places that they have gone. That they have no business has been there. I send the release of the blood. The blood that never loses power. I declare the blood to reign on the earth. I say reign and set these souls free. Reign, oh God, and release them from the bad habit. Be it drugs, be it alcohol, be it fornication, be it instability, be it lack of marriage, be it sicknesses, be it diseases, be it tears, be it disappointment, be it poverty. Male katabo yikasakana. Be a lack of thinking, be a laziness, be a madness. I like a bow, she kiri baba baba so koro bo ye ke tabo ika sabala baba 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 ita ta 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 ta
Begin to release them. Begin to release them. Begin to open that pressing gate. Right now, I call upon you, Lord Jesus. I say, open every pressing gate. Every engagement. Every engagement. Every pressing gate. Everywhere they have locked and cut it. I set them free with the blood of Jesus. By the authority of God, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I set them free in the name of Jesus. I declare your word to be spoken in their life right now. Break. Break, 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 loose, 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 loose your children. Father, they come before you and not before me. My love shake I said, break, Lord Jesus. Begin to break that. Begin to break this racing. Begin to break this virus. Begin to break these chains. Begin to break this locks. Begin to break this bottle. Oh, yeah. 